Maybe one day he'll start that charity he's talking about. Maybe not. But until then, I just want you to understand something the next time you're thinking of trusting a financial influencer. These promotional deals, how they work with things like FTX is that there's a code associated with it that tracks sales. For example, you might have heard of somebody saying, hey, use code CoffeeZilla or, you know, they have some link, right? So FTX can see how many people signed up with Kevin's link or Shaq's link. And you know who takes responsibility when it's time to make money? The influencer. They take responsibility for you joining their platform. That's how FTX Group, they paid all these people who wanted to be responsible for bringing you in. But you know what happens when things go wrong? Suddenly, they're not responsible. You did it. It's on you. Isn't that a convenient switch up of who brought you in? At first, it was them. And then you brought yourself in. You got to take responsibility for your own actions. And I just don't think this is really working for people anymore. I think it really just benefits the influencers and the financial companies, but hardly anyone else. It's bad for regular people. And I think there just really needs to be new rules in place about financial experts in the modern era. But hey, that's just my opinion. Hashtag not financial advice.